Here at Voidspan, we are dedicated to the development of new technologies for the sympathetic restoration and stabilization of our historic infrastructure. Older masonry structures were built with more breathable, lower strength mortar materials than used today. They must be restored using products that are physically and compositionally compatible. The Voidspan Port Anchor is a patented stainless steel Syntex sock anchor system that ties separated layers of masonry together while providing a port through which to clean and grout inject the separations. Our Pozzolanic hydraulic line products are Pozzolan line formulations with ultra low shrinkage and surprisingly high adhesion for their moderate strengths. Voidspan Pozzolanic hydraulic line grouts and binders are breathable, low to moderate strength materials with a variety of uses in the restoration of older masonry structures. They contain a blended hydraulic binder and sand with less than 2% chemical admixtures by weight. Our formulations contain lime, pozzolan, and in our PHLC products, a very small amount of cement. By combining the forgiving properties of lime with the more rapid, airless cure of a hydraulic binder, we have created more breathable, softer materials that are compatible with historic masonry structures while meeting the logistical demands of today. Our careful, quality-controlled blending of lime and pozzolan in just the right proportion allows for complete reaction of the lime without the residuals that can bleed out of the masonry and cause streaking in non-hydraulic lime applications. Voidspan pozzolanic hydraulic lime grouts and binders contain no significant chlorides or corrosive materials. The ultra-low 0.06% shrinkage is achieved without the use of chemical shrinkage compensators, which can sometimes cause damage when in contact with embedded metal elements. Voidspan pozzolanic hydraulic lime grouts and binders are extremely frost resistant. For example, in laboratory freeze-thaw tests, our PHLC has repeatedly outlasted traditional mortar formulations, with freeze-thaw resistance approaching that of Indiana limestone. Our voidspan grouts are more breathable than most cement grouts and within close range of most late 19th century and early to mid 20th century mortars. Our grouts are also more adhesive than cohesive with the tenacious bond to substrate materials. The intent is to accommodate forced movement sacrificially rather than through debonding or causing damage to the substrate. Even with their lower, more compatible strength, Voidspan hydraulic lime grouts are structurally stable and predictable materials. Voidspan PHLC can be used as a combination void filler and structural adhesive on large scale applications and is specifically formulated to support daily 3 foot grout lifts with limited bracing. The first 3 foot lift is able to support its own weight plus 2 fluid 3 foot lifts above it within 2 days. Voidspan PHLC 70 has similar mechanical properties but is specifically formulated for smaller scale applications. Here we see Voidspan PHLC gravity feed grout being mixed and then fed into a cavity. Alright. So how long have you been using this stuff, Andy? Six months Great. using Voidspan. How do you like it? I love it. Great product. What have you been using it for? I've been using it to fill the voids between uh, uh, three ply brick wall, filling the air space. How, ma how, much, how much material do you think you've used so far? Uh, we've used probably about 15 super sacks, I'd 15 say. super sacks. Just about. Start mixing it up a little bit at a time. A high speed drill. A little more dry mix. How long have you been doing this for? Uh, this is going to be going on 11 years. 11 years. Yeah. And you're pretty innovative with it too. Yeah. Special, special areas. Yeah. Yep, yeah, we, uh, this is a product that at first we had to learn about, and now getting comfortable with it, you can play around with the consistency to some degree and what it can do. You just pour in enough in there to get it to do what yeah, I like to do. I like to start off with uh, small batches. Just start a little bit, add a little bit of water. A little bit of dry, a little bit of water. Just to, you know, get the consistency where I want.
the whole team been using this for the whole day? Uh, yep, this one. Everyone on the crew except for a couple folks. Uh, give them a little crash course on how to mix and what it does and give it go. Very user friendly. Mix it real well. Get all the warm stuff, nothing in it. There you go. A little water. Cody's gonna dump the board stand in. Dump it all the way. We've also just dumped it buckets into the wall. But for this application, pump seems to be the best way. And if you look in the hole, it's nice because it will actually coat the back of the pier. So that way it ensures it won't leak out anywhere. It's a good coat. And they've been using that one for gravity feed. Yep, yeah, this has been for the gravity feed. And up above on these piers, we'll go back to the bucket. And just pour it in. Dump, dump it right in. But for this right now, this is the sand. What's the diameter of that pipe there you're holding? Uh, this is about two and a half inch. Outside? Yeah, outside. Alright. Right. That's all, folks. <laughs> <laughs>